What's up money? So let's talk about some meme coins. I feel like this video is kind of long overdue. There's some meme coins that I haven't mentioned in a very long time. So I want to talk about them today. I think I'm going to put them all in my description so you guys know which meme coins that I'm going to be talking about. Now, the first one that I want to go over is Hoppy here. This one is very interesting. The first time I spoke about this one was, what, maybe two weeks ago, I think, something like that. And this one has been crashing with the overall markets. You know, when the overall market comes down, meme coins are gonna come down harder. It's just the way that it goes because whatever runs higher comes down harder. You know, like look at this parabolic move. Anyways, I'm gonna blow up the charts in just a second. But Hoppy right now is sitting at a market cap of 24.17 million. Lots of liquidity, over 12,000 holders. Let's take a closer look at this here. All right, so let's change this over to market cap. As you can see, this thing had a insane parabolic move because from May 13th all the way up to July 6th, this thing went parabolic. This thing was sitting at a market cap of 524,000 and it went to a market cap of 87 million nothing runs forever so of course it had to come back down and it's come down all right it came down heavily there was a massive correction which was absolutely necessary but if i'm being honest i thought the correction was going to end around here around the 38 million dollar market cap but that did not happen it just broke through this area but look at the date july 20th July 25th, a lot of altcoins started to come down around that point also. So of course, this one's going to break this resistance area. It had four touches, you know, four touches before breaking through. So it tried, just unfortunately just couldn't hold up. The open market was going down. It came down with it. But, you know, it bottomed out on August 5th with overall market at a $14 million market cap. And it had a nice pump because it went from 14 million to 27 million. So that was a pretty sizable pump there. If anyone caught this at the bottom and rode that wave, congrats. Most pop, most people probably didn't. But right now it's trading in this area. It's been here for a few days around, let's say 23 million, 21 to so about 21 to 25 million um, market cap area. Let's hope that it can actually hold up. I think that because the overall market is starting to kind of make its way up, at least it kind of seems like it. It's kind of trading sideways, actually, for the most part. But as long as the market continues to go up, then I think this one is going to make a bounce back. This is one that I don't think that it's over yet. Not yet. I definitely don't think it's over. So I definitely still have hopes for Hoppy here as long as meme coin season goes. If meme coin season completely ends and we enter a bear market, then all of these coins I'm going to be talking about today is in complete danger. Let's take a look at their Twitter. There's not much going on here, right? You, you can see that they post consistently, which is definitely fantastic but we want to see some exchange listings. Let's take a look at foreign market cap here and see all the exchange listings that it's on. So there's quite a few, which is great. There's CoinW here. I have a link to CoinW for anyone that wants to get happy on CoinW. You can check my link in my description down below. Um, but yeah, there's a quite a few listings, which is good. The only thing is we need more because just like Turbo, Turbo has exchange listings which feels like every single day so we're going to need the same type of you know listings as turbo if we want to continue to make some serious parabolic moves and continue to hold on to our gains market cap wise anyways so hoppy is still doing its thing we need some more exchange listings once that starts to happen then i can definitely see hoppy going back up towards its all-time high it's still a night rider it's still I look at this as like Pepe's like ugly step brother or something like that. But it's still, you know, going to make people money in my personal opinion. None of this is financial advice, though. But that's Hoppy. 
let's go over to the next one here. This one I haven't talked about in an insane long time. This is Maneki. And the thing about this one is, man, it's just, it's been kind of brutal. The market cap is still pretty high, which is great. It's at a $43 million market cap with lots of liquidity, 77,000 holders. But when you look at the price, I mean, just, it's kind of rough, you know, like, it's kind of rough, let's be honest, because this thing went parabolic, went to $247 million market cap. My gosh, and right now it's sitting at $43 million. Like, are we going to reach these highs again? If I'm being honest with everybody, I honestly don't know. It's going to be tough. It's really going to be tough. I think that we can definitely reach the high of $109 million market cap from where we are. But to go all the way up to $250 million market cap, those, that's ways to go. There's got, there's got to be a lot going on for it to head back up there. And right now, looking at it, if I zoom in a little bit, so it bottomed out with the rest of the market here, and it went to about $29 million market cap, bounced up to $50 million market cap, came down to, let's call this a $30 million, and right now $43 million. It's hard to say where this one's going to go. It really is. Let's take a look at the amount of exchange listings that they're on. So they're on quite a bit. So they've been doing their thing. It's not like, you know, they were just sitting around not trying to get exchange listings. They've got exchange listings. So people have easy access to this one. So that's a good sign. As long as there's lots of exchange listings for this for a meme coin, you know that the potential is still there. If it doesn't have a lot of exchange listings then you sweat a little bit more <laughs> it's just the way that it goes all right but Maneki still got it's still got potential if you go over their twitter account let's see here go all the way back to the top 57.8 thousand followers has got there's a lot of people still eyeing this one they still post consistently like they post every single day so that's definitely a good sign and it's a cat meme coin and some of these cat meme coins they just surprise people. Before you know it, they're just in the top 100 on core market cap. So you don't really know with this one. I'm definitely keeping an eye out on it and see where things go. All right. But that's Maneki for you. If you guys are in this one, don't give up. I think that you still have hope. If you don't believe in it, though, then you should consider um, shortening your bag, depending on how much you have, because you want to be able to sleep at night. That's the most important thing. You don't want to be holding something and it's like, oh, man, is this thing going to zero? I don't know. So make sure that you manage your risk at all times. Now, let's go on to the last one here. And this one is Bird Dog on base. I'm actually impressed with the gains that's it's being that's being held up here because when I first started talking about this one, I believe the market cap was about 200 and something thousand. And right now the market cap is 672. So it's still above where I initially talked about it. And I talked about it way back. Like it's been a while actually. Um, where did I start talking about this thing? It must have been, yeah, right before that pump. It was probably around here. So maybe like May 27th area I started talking about it and it went just parabolic, absolutely parabolic, right? So people made some good money on its way down. I started to make videos and I was like, guys, consider take some profits because we don't know where this thing is going to go. Hopefully you guys had been taking profits. If not, you're still up on your investment, which is a good sign at least, but yeah, always take profits on the way up because we never know what these meme coins, the way things are looking right now. So where's August 5th here? So August 5th, it went to a $518,000 $518, market cap. That is impressive. It still hasn't given back its gains where it crashed. I mean, where it took off from all the way back here. That is, that is actually very impressive. I'm, I am very impressed with this one. Like it's, yeah, wow, that's, that's crazy. But, um, 
yeah, so clearly there's some strength in this one. It is a boys club meme coin anyway, so I guess I shouldn't be that surprised that it's holding up um, the way that it's holding up. Let's take a look at here. Let's see on their Twitter. They don't really have a lot of followers, only 1,200 followers. That's not necessarily a bad thing because at least you know that they're not paying for their followers. This seems more authentic to me, 1,200 followers. So that's all right. Um, you scroll through their Twitter account. They're still active. They posted six hours ago, eight hours ago. So they're still doing their thing. So we'll see where Bird Dog goes. Um, it's definitely interesting. But anyways, that's all I have for you guys today. I just want to touch on these meme coins because I felt like I haven't talked about them in quite some time. So I just want to bring it up. If you guys have any meme coin suggestions, you know, if there's any meme coin that I haven't talked about in a while and you're curious to know what's the latest on it, just let me know in the comments section below and I'll definitely consider talking about it in one of my recent upcoming videos. But thank you all for watching. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button if you haven't already. And until next time, take care.